The Southern Poverty Law Center, which is a, a left wing attack group, has called the Family Research Council a hate group for years. And now a conservative college grad who joined uh, the Family Research Council just for a radio interview is under fire for being linked to that organization. Hannah Sherlocker just wrote about the experience. She says the bullying tactics against conservatives need to stop. Uh, Hannah Sherlocker is joining us now. She's the program coordinator for CampusReform.org, and she joins us live. Hannah, thanks for joining us this morning. So uh, just to get the facts out there, you were on a radio program hosted by Tony Perkins. He runs the Family Research Council. You did an interview. It must have been about something hate-related, right? If, you, if you've been designate, designated by the Southern Poverty Law Center as an enabler of hate, what was the topic of that radio interview? The topic was about socialism. Oh, so yeah. how I got on an anti-LGBT list is beyond me. Um, you know, Southern Poverty Law Center responded to the article I wrote by debating the semantics of which list I was on. But, you know, bottom line, when anyone is placed on any of Southern Poverty Law Center's list, the message is clear. It's a memorandum to their supporters that I am the enemy. And they are willing and ready and working to um, do anything to dispose of conservative First Amendment rights. And this time I was the target. But, you know, for millions of Americans, this is their story, too. Just look at how SPLC labeled Dr. Ben Carson or um, Dr. Carol Swain, who is an African-American yes. professor at Vanderbilt, who was labeled a white sympathizer. So, you know, there's no credibility, and groups like this are dangerous. They're reckless and irresponsible in labeling people as haters, and it has serious implications for not only their careers, but their safety. Of course. I mean, you were, you were labeled, you were on a, put on this list, well, and you were targeted, but not physically targeted yet. But in 2012, the, the Southern Poverty Law Center put out a hate map, which included the Family Research Council. And someone walked in there and shot up the lobby, uh, as, as, and citing that as part of the reason they were there. This targeting, what is it meant to do, Hannah? Why do you think you're on this list, and what are they trying to do to you? They're trying to silence me, as for years they've been trying to silence conservatives. It's a bully tactic. And what I find ironic about this is of the 917 groups they deem hateful, there's not a single message of Antifa, resist, by any means necessary, which are all domestic terrorist organizations that operate and incite violence on our college campuses. I work with college students across the nation at Leadership Institute's campus reform, and they are constantly bullied, attacked, and ostracized by groups like these. And it's, it's disheartening that they're they're not put on this list, but someone like me is put on this list for doing a radio interview for a conservative um, show. This is this is absurd. It's bullying in its purest form, and it needs to stop. And we need to push back against it. Yeah, Hannah, as you pointed out, it, you know their their desires also to damage any long term or other long term career prospects. Thankfully, folks like you have a, have a strong voice, and you're pushing back.